Hello guys. Welcome back to our channel. In this video, I will be showing you how to fix the problem of error address unreachable on Google Chrome. So, if you are facing this type of error, this video will help you and solve it. The first thing you need to do is restart your Google Chrome and check whether that fixes your problem because sometimes that's where the problem is coming from. The other thing you can do is restart your router because this issue might pop up if the router you are using has an error state. To do this, turn off your router's power supply and leave it off for about 5 minutes. After that you can now turn it on and connect your computer to your router and check if the problem disappears. Depending on the router you are using, there might be a different way to restart your own. Just check your router manufacturer's website for more information. Now let's start with the actual software solution for the error problem. So the first way is to update your Google Chrome. To update your Google Chrome, simply launch Google Chrome and click on the three dots on the top right corner, then go down to where we have help and click it. In the help go to about Google Chrome. And once you're there, you will see if there is any update available for Google Chrome. If there is, just install and check whether that will fix the error problem. The next way is to clear down the Google Chrome cache data. So for that, just open your Google Chrome and then again go to the three dots and there just click on settings, then choose privacy and security and then click on clear browsing data option. Then from the drop down option and select all time and checkmark cache images and files and cookies and other site data options. After that, clear the data and restart your browser and check whether that fixes the problem. The next way is to disable unnecessary Chrome extensions. Go to the three dots again and select Extensions. In the Extensions just disable all the unnecessary third-part extensions that might have cased this issue and check whether that fixes the problem. If it does not, you can start reinstalling the extension and see which one is making the issue and you can simply click on Remove to remove it. Now next solution is to turn off the proxy server. For you to do this, go to your Windows search bar and search for Settings. Once you open settings, select network and internet and then go to proxy. In the proxy click on setup next to the use a proxy server option, then under use a proxy server just disable it. After that, click on save and restart your computer and check whether that fixes the problem. Hope this video is helpful to you. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe to our channel for more updates like this. If you are still having same problem use the comment section below and tell us. Thanks for watching.